by the end of this video, you'll have everything you need to confidently go into your first CDH game, prepare to learn, and have a great time. I'm Matthew, this is Lamora's Cards, and today we're going to go step by step through exactly what you need to do to play your first CDH game. Like and subscribe if this is your vibe, but either way, let's get into it. First, CDH is a specific meta of Magic the Gathering's Commander format. If you know how to play Magic and Commander, good news, you're about 80% of the way there. If not, I recommend these videos to learn the basic rules and congratulations on finding your newest obsession. So, you know how to play Commander. What's the difference between this and CDH? From a rules perspective, nothing. You already know how to play CDH. The primary difference is player intention. CDH players use decks optimized for winning. Not necessarily the deck they think is the best, but a deck they choose to knowingly take into the most powerful possible games of Commander. Now there are a lot of specifics that go into what defines the CDH metagame, and I would recommend checking out my video, CDH Beginner's Guide, to quickly get caught up on popular archetypes, cards, and and decks. So, now you know what CDH is, but you need a deck to play. If you've come here from gameplay content, you may already know what you want to play. Or perhaps your casual Niv-Mizzet or Urza deck has outpaced your playgroup's power level and you want to level it up. First, I'd recommend checking out this video, the top 5 CDH decks for new players. It goes over some popular and straightforward decks that you can get into games with no problem. My Learn to Play series features some other decks that you won't see in the top 5, like niv Mizzet, Kess, and Jessica Ishai, that could be good to check out if you don't like any shown in that video. I'd very strongly recommend watching one of these for your deck if it's available. They're short, feature extremely knowledgeable players, and get you all the basic info for the deck. The Discord group, CDHU, can also help you find a deck you want to play based on your playstyle and has experienced pilots that can help you improve with it. You can also use the Moxville Playtester with any of these lists to get a feel for it. So now you have a deck picked out, but we need the cards. I do not ever recommend buying real magic cards. The CDH community is very proxy friendly, so feel free to use them. If you have the real cards or already know how to make proxies, great, you're covered. But for those who don't, I'll walk through the process that I like to use. First, find the deck you want to use. More than likely, it's on Moxfield because Moxfield is the best. Click on More, Export, and then click Copy for MTGO. Now, I like to use MTG Print, but there's plenty of other sites you can use for this. Paste the list. Now you can go through and pick the art you want for each card. Now, if you're going to use your own printer, you can print here. Usually, though, I'll get a PDF and have it printed at Staples. It's around $8 a deck there, and they have pretty nice quality. You may be able to get it cheap at your local library or another store. Now you want to get those cut out, which does kind of take forever, but when you're all done, now all you have left is backing and sleeving. You have a lot of bulk lying around, that works, but I actually prefer getting cheap playing cards and using those, since they're the same dimensions, only a bit thinner, giving you something closer to a real magic card feel once you've got the papers in there. I've got three decks for a dollar at Dollar Tree and that's pretty hard to beat. Get those sleeved up and you're ready to play. Here's a good point to do some IRL gold fishing, getting used to the feel of the deck and its mulligans. Now if you're really lucky, you'll already know someone who plays or have players at your store who play CDH. If not, you have spell table webcam based gameplay as an option. You don't even need a webcam, just your phone, computer, and a place to play. Now, if you have no ability to use spell table through a camera, you can skip the steps about cutting out a deck and instead use the Moxfield play tester on spell table. Video on how to do that here, or you could use programs like Cockatrice, Tabletop Simulator, or Untapped.in that simulate magic gameplay. There are a lot of different discords you can find games in, servers like Competitive EDH, CDH Nexus, My Muscle Magic, and Maps Queendom are all great places to catch spell table games, as well as talk to other players to help you out and make friends. And that's it, you're now in your first CDH game. It May seem a little daunting and you'll make mistakes along the way but keep at it and you'll be killing it in no time thank you so much for watching let me know if you need any help anywhere along the way and go have fun